many symptoms, one test, Avise CTD. This video is a simplified illustration of the latest concepts on how C4D is deposited on host cells as a result of the classical complement activation cascade. This area of scientific discovery continues to evolve and as such, advancements continue to emerge. Complement activation plays a critical role in the immune system, including the clearance of foreign or damaged material from the body. Many patients with SLE experience activation of the classical complement pathway, which is suspected to play a pathogenic role in SLE. When classical complement activation increases, soluble complement levels decrease. This is frequently associated with increases in SLE disease activity. Measuring the parent proteins C3 and C4 is imperfect and subject to the following confounding factors. Individual variability, protein synthesis and catabolism, acute phase reactants. Measuring cell-bound complement activation products, or CB caps, reduces the impact from these variability factors. Elements of classical complement pathway. CB caps offer a stable measure which more closely reflects complement activation and thus disease activity. In response to the presence of a microbe or cellular debris, an antibody complex forms which is then bound by C1QRS complex. Then circulating C4 binds to the C1QRS complex, thereby consuming and reducing circulating levels. C4 breaks away from the C1QRS complex, shedding anaphylatoxin C4A and leaving C4B to bind to the circulating molecules in the vicinity. When C4B binds to cellular debris, microbes, or other foreign molecules, it continues the complement cascade leading to consumption of C3. However, when bound to a host cell such as erythrocytes or B cells, the membrane cofactor protein MCP or CD46 along with factor I mediates a modification that creates IC4B. This terminal action sheds off C4C, leaving C4D as an artifact of the immune complex formation and enduring evidence of complement activation. C4D remains attached to the host cell for the life of that cell by way of a thioester covalent bond, allowing it to be measured as a stable marker of complement activity and providing insight into the diagnosis of SLE. In a recent validation study, CB caps demonstrated a 22% increased sensitivity over C3 and C4 in detection of SLE. Many symptoms, one test, Avise CTD. For more information, please visit www.avisetest.com.